In The Ravishing of L.O.L. Stein, Marguerite Duras explores themes of desire, obsession, and the complexities of human relationships through the lens of a fragmented narrative and evocative prose. The novel is set in the coastal town of S., where L.O.L. Stein, a young woman, experiences a profound emotional trauma following her lover's betrayal. This incident leaves her in a state of paralysis, symbolizing a deeper exploration of love and loss, and establishing a tone that resonates with melancholy and longing. The structure of the narrative mirrors LOL's fragmented psyche. Duras employs a nonlinear storytelling method, shifting between past and present, allowing readers to experience the disorientation and confusion that LOL herself feels. The narrative is rich with introspection, often diving deep into the inner thoughts of characters, particularly LOL, as she grapples with her feelings of abandonment and isolation. Duras's prose is marked by its lyrical quality, creating an almost dreamlike atmosphere that enhances the emotional weight of the story. The use of repetition and circular storytelling reinforces LOL's obsessive nature, revealing her inability to escape her memories and emotions. At the heart of the novel is the relationship between LOL and her former lover, Jacques Hold. Their love affair is not simply a romantic engagement but also a complex interplay of power dynamics, social expectations, and personal desires. Jacques' eventual abandonment of LOL catalyzes her emotional unraveling, and this betrayal becomes a focal point of her identity. As she retreats into a world of nostalgia, the reader witnesses the consequences of unrequited love and the impact of societal norms on personal relationships. Duras deftly examines the notion of possession in love, for LOL, love is not only an experience of intimacy but also an experience of loss and domination. The secondary characters serve as a reflection of LOL's inner turmoil and further complicate the themes of the narrative. The enigmatic figure of the narrator, who remains detached yet omniscient, guides the reader through LOL's emotional landscape. Characters such as Tatiana and the older woman who becomes involved with Jacques are not merely plot devices but symbols of the different facets of femininity and desire. They embody the competing desires and societal roles that women navigate, ultimately amplifying LOL's feelings of inadequacy and disillusionment. Duras's portrayal of women in this narrative emphasizes the societal constraints placed upon them, suggesting that their identities are often defined by their relationships with men. The motif of the seaside setting plays a crucial role in the novel. The beach serves as a backdrop for both longing and reflection. It is a place where LOL grapples with her memories, and the constant ebb and flow of the tide mirrors her emotional state, oscillating between hope and despair. Duras paints vivid imagery of the landscape, using it to evoke the emotional undercurrents that shape LOL's experiences. The setting becomes a character in its own right, enhancing the themes of isolation and longing. Duras also engages with the notion of time and memory throughout the narrative. The passage of time is fluid, often blurring the lines between past and present. LOL's memories are fragmented and disjointed, revealing how trauma distorts one's perception of reality. The interplay between memory and identity is a central concern in the novel, LOL's past continually intrudes upon her present, shaping her actions and relationships. This exploration of memory underscores the theme of obsession, as LOL becomes trapped in a cycle of recollection that hinders her ability to move forward. Ultimately, The Ravishing of LOL Stein is a poignant exploration of the complexities of love, loss, and identity. Duras's use of fragmented narrative, evocative prose, and rich symbolism invites readers to engage with LOL's emotional landscape deeply. Through LOL's journey, the novel raises questions about the nature of desire, the societal roles of women, and the intricacies of human relationships. In its haunting portrayal of a woman's psychological unraveling, the novel remains a profound meditation on the intricacies of the human condition, making it a timeless work of literature that resonates with readers across generations.